I did a video on the best and not so best films of Chuck Norris. So now I'm doing the best and not so best films of Steven Seagal, martial artist and actor. Now I'm not going to go through a laundry list of Steven Seagal's biography uh, of all of his films because it's probably 20 or more films that he's done but I will touch on the ones that I'm really really familiar with uh, in his earlier career when he was thinner didn't have all of, all of the weight on him uh, I want to say this I'm gonna say the best in my estimation above the law this is Steven Seagal's movies moon movie credits Above the law, we have Hard to Kill, his two very best films, uh, mind you, Under Siege 1 and 2. Now On Deadly Ground would be the fifth one, however, uh, I say that it was sort of a question mark because uh, I still give it number 5 as being his best, one of his better films, I'll put it like that. But that's when he started going down a little bit and started making a lot of B-movies, more of a B-movie type of thing after that. And his popularity as a martial arts movie uh, guy sort of started, it started to wane. And uh, he began to make a lot of only going to DVD type of movies. So um, I won't mention all of those as I said before, but uh, Hard to Kill, Above the Law, Under Siege, Part 1 and 2, and then uh, On Deadly Ground would be the top films that Steven Seagal has ever done. I want to say this, I love the man as a martial artist. I don't discount anyone's ability or skill level. I know that there's a lot of talk out there and there's a lot of Steven Seagal haters saying that he's told lies about who he taught certain things to in the MMA and so forth. I'm not interested in any of that right now. I'm talking about his credit as a martial arts as a martial artist and then even his acting in martial arts. And those were the first five that I put on the top and everything else didn't make the grade. They're very, very subpar. But with that, I'm going to leave you and I'm going to ask you what do you think his better movies were out of his laundry list of movies again. That was it and that was all. I'm out.